What's up everybody, hope you're all doing great. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good morning, hope you all had a great weekend too. And welcome to this video in which we will cover LTO. Uh, the LTO token or the LTO network, whatever you want to call it. And if you know me, you uh, knew that I was going to cover it the moment it got a little bit more bullish. Definitely with the volume going up 500% up to 25 million right now, where it used to be earlier today, it used to be around 4 million. Um, which still isn't bad compared to the market cap. It's more than more than 10%, but it's it's relative to other cryptos. It's not a lot of money. So LTO, I've been a holder of LTO for a long time, uh, for a long time. So that's a quick disclosure. Uh, I think the project has potential, but um, definitely has to still prove that. I think. Um, so yeah, just covering it because it's relatively bullish today. It's it's up about about 20 to 22% against the market. 17% in itself volume as I said has become a little bit better so if we take a look at the price um, you can actually see that we re reached the stop about an hour ago probably a little bit later if you're watching this video so but that's fine reach that top so what I basically think is that um, this is going to be a spike all right I, I don't suspect we'll have a bull run with LTO just just right out of the gate i have to be honest with you about that i mean there, there there's a small possibility um that will actually get get some sort of a bull run with lto and what that small possibility is is that we'll be able to break above this level right here uh, between 12 and a half cents and 13 cents and i'm going to delete this trend line because i think it's useless um, if we're able to break above that level, then yes, sure, we can get a bull run all the way up to 15 and 15 and a half cents. I, I genuinely think so. Um, and I think it's realistic, but it's it's not the most realistic scenario at this point of time, I think. And you can also see that, I mean, LTO has already dropped down significantly, which we can see by doing this, at least on Binance, all right? So prices differ. We've already dropped 14% from that local top, which we reached at 12.50. See on Binance, it's a it's a little bit higher. It's always a little bit more volatile. That's that's just what you tend to see. Doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, so so what I expect, we could still do something like this. All right, we we could still reach that 13, uh, 13 cents level, but as long as we don't break it, um, I think we're going to drop down soon too. All right, Wednesday we got an interest rate decision from the Federal Reserve, which is probably going to be bearish. Um, at least for the market so you do see some sort of a, a bullish bullish structure for lto but that could very easily switch to a range or to, or to a consolidation and i think that's going to happen i think we're going to going to fall down so i think we're going to fall down from where we are right now we could also still reach 13 cents and then drop down um to be honest that's that's very hard to predict right now and then i think we'll find some support at 10 cents but only to afterwards drop down to nine and a half cents. Nine and a half cents might actually hold for a longer period of time, but I don't think it's going to hold if Bitcoin uh, keeps dropping. Then I think we're going to uh, drop all the way down to 8.7 cents. And from there, I think that level could hold. Um, but then again, you have to know that if the market crashes, obviously it's not going to hold. And obviously we're going to drop down to the seven and seven and a half cents area. Just want to prepare you for that. For now, I do think this will hold and I will probably update it if I think it will not. Um, but you should know that if the market crashes, I mean, the, the strongest support for LTO right now is around this seven and a half cents area. All right, so just know that. So that's basically my, my analysis on LTO for now. If you do have any questions about it, please let me know down in the comments. And for now, I want to thank you all for watching and listening and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.